things that my work has always been concerned with is photography as it lives in our culture. And in this show, I have begun to use the studio as a site for making my work, really to incorporate the process of the studio into the work itself. I'm very interested in the more sculptural material presence of uh, the photographs as objects. So th the window is covered with white paper and then I put an object in front of it and in this case I put blue paper over part of the window and the blue light coming from one side is contrasted against the white light coming from the other and the bowl is split in half down the middle. And I just used the, the phenomena of the light itself as it plays in the studio as, a, as my subject matter. This also is the studio window. And I covered the window at this point with black velvet paper and cut a small aperture in it and hung a circular prism in front of that aperture. So what you see in, in this image is the actual spectral light. I had been working in my studio and I have a big picture window there that I have covered with transparent white paper. And I have a four by five camera that was just sitting in front of the window and I was saying, well, doesn't that camera look great? So I got another four by five camera and took a picture of my four by five camera. And then I said, well, yeah, but that's not quite enough. And I built it into a diptych with one camera right side up and the other camera upside down and a negative and created a diptych out of it, playing with the idea of what a camera does, what a camera looks like and how a camera operates. One of the things that I was engaging is the, the distinction between the traditional fine art photographs, which are sort of more observational documentary or journalistic, and a, a lot of the more postmodern pictures generation work, of, which I, I would consider myself that school. And so in this show, one of the things I was trying to do was to sort of break down the, the distinction between those. So some of the pieces in, in the exhibition are clearly very composed, constructed images, but I also included images of the studio itself in the process of making work. So I was trying to kind of break down the barrier between a finished object and the work as it was evolving in the studio. I like the idea of ha having the studio become animated and each of the pieces has a little bit of magic or mystery in it. 